Hi Leo, this is your reading for the week of the 28th of May. Angel, Spirit, Guides, Universe, what would you like Leo to know about this week? What would you like Leo to know about this week of the 28th of May? Would you like Leo? A lot of cards want to come out here, Leo. Angels, Spirit, Guides and the Universe, what would you like Leo to know about the next seven days from the 28th of May? What is the energy? What's the guidance for Leo, please? What's the guidance for Leo about this week of the... 28th of May please angels spirit guides universe what would you like Leo to know about this week of the 28th of May okay all right on the bottom of the deck we've got the knight of wands someone's wanting some fun uh passionate fun they want to rush in and out they want to go and have a drink have some rock and roll uh, but this person normally comes in and uh, flies back out again. You've got the Ten of Pentacles with the Five of Swords. It's like you might have been stopped from an inheritance. You might have had a row with somebody over stability um, or having a family. There could be a burnt bridge here. There's a termination here. Uh, someone is gossiping or bringing in news or a message this week, they've been spying on you and they're desperate to talk to you, travel with you, or they could be at a distance and they're coming towards you by air. Um, there's a flight this week, someone's wanting to go traveling with you. It's a clear stretch of fruitful activity. Someone is reciprocating some energy, you might have the money you get, the money you need to do this, this creative business. And um, you're going to go on a date with somebody, which is a happy time, a birthday or some kind of date or a group of women. Could be a Hindu. Uh, someone's like giving you money to go on this, this date or this celebration. There's been a lot of communication here, maybe after a burnt bridge where you didn't get the money that you wanted or you got the money and then had the row with the person over money. Um, we do have a death card here. This could be you're dealing with a Scorpio. Um, but it's a transformation of life, uh, not without some tears or pain. But um, this Knight of Swords is coming in. They want to talk to you. They want to have your back on things. This could be a brother. Um, and they're coming in to offer some kind of stability towards you. They want, they're, they're, they're wanting to offer something grounded something solid for the future but you know your worth you know your worth and you're willing to wait for to invest your energy or your money you're waiting you're hanging around there could be some kind of sacrifice or a termination of something an ending again because you self-sabotage it too were over worried about it but it only lasts one night it's this lack of sleep or this worry immediately you get the ace of swords which is the truth it's like your mind is cleared after having like you might have a dream or something spiritual happen to you or someone says they want to invest in you and then but there's some kind of what if this turns out like before or what if that's a monster on the back of the door and not a coat and then you wake up the next day and you've got absolute clarity absolute truth um your worries are what's the word you don't have to worry basically leo um someone there's a lot of options coming in for you and someone wants what you want they they, they want to make a choice they want to make they want to talk about uh what you want and how this is going to work um are we going to live together? Are, where are we going to live? Where is this relationship going? Are we going to get married? Um, it's like, what do you want now? You can have whatever you want at the end of this week. But you, you, you're kind of um, investing, wondering what to invest in. And you're, it's like you've been waiting a long time to invest in this thing. We've been waiting for this thing a long time. Then you get this worry. Someone says something that's really worrying. But then it sorts itself out i really wouldn't worry you get absolute clarity and someone says well what do you want um let's ask the romance angels for leo please what would you like leo to know about this week of the 28th of may for leo please leo 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 leo, leo. you could get the truth about someone just sort of seven of cups can mean pie in the sky that someone's lying or they're they're just 
writing checks they can't cash and that's what the truth is uh, it's not, it, you'll find out it's not the thing you thought it was unrequited love there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going now what that doesn't mean it's over or anything like that it's like there's something someone wants to reciprocate something to you they want to communicate but an ending is going to occur here but it could be with a Gemini because you know you're worth Leo angel spirit guides universe you want to invest elsewhere it's like I don't want to be dealing with people that fly in all the time on these horses and fly back out again I've got to I need someone solid like me angel spirit guides what would you like Leo to know Leo 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 or maybe this is the other person saying to you stop flying in and out of my life Leo angel spirit guides worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life calling in your soulmate your prayers affirmations and visualizations help bring you together and children your love life is being affected by children it could be that someone wants children and you don't and that's what the the, the beef is um but someone does want to give equally here it's saying you're calling someone in and they're worth waiting for. If this isn't the one for you and you've ended something recently, um, there's something new coming in for you. You're going to have a lot of options, Leo. Um, let's ask the angels. What would you like, Leo, to know about this week of the 28th of May for Leo? You are a spiritual teacher. You have the ability to counsel others and help them awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life mission. I'm leading you toward the answer to your prayers. Please listen to and follow the steps I'm communicating through your intuition, thoughts and dreams. Yeah, you might have some kind of bad dream about someone and then wake up and realise what you want. It's like, no, that is what I want or that that is the thing I, I need or we've got courage. Be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. Um, and we've got this truth. So you might go out on a date with someone this week and, and end something with someone else because there's someone else coming in here that wants to chat to you. Angel spirit guides, universe. They might want to offer you security. Angels, but you're hedging your bets. So someone like doesn't know whether to invest, so they're going to wait. And in that waiting period, you get very, very worried or they get very worried. And all of a sudden, after this clarity happens, this dream or something, someone knows exactly what they want and they're going to choose and i think that's or you're going to have so many doors open angel spirit guides leo please would you like leo to know would you like leo to know would you like leo to know there could be travel this week with somebody angel spirit guides what would you like leo to know leo leo sorry the one's not coming out the person most on leo's mind please what would they like to say to leo the person most on leo's mind what would they like to say to leo Obviously, they've got a lot to say. <laughs> I can't take that many. It's the whole deck. Um, angels, spirit guides, what would they like to say to Leo? What would this person most on Leo's mind, what would they like to say to Leo if they could? What would they like to say? I left you when I saw you with someone. I replay our conversations over and over. Angels, spirit guides, what would they like to say to Leo? What would Leo's person like to say to them? You speak to me through music. Angel spirit guides. What would Leo's person like to say to me? One more card, please. The person most on Leo's mind. I want to tell you how I feel. And my life is not as together as it seems. So someone's definitely wanting to speak to you. Um, but they're a bit scared that they're not good enough, that they're too young. Or that they, there's something that they're worried about that they think they're not good enough. Um, but you know your worth, and I'll leave it there. Take care, Leo. Have the courage this week, and I will speak to you soon. Please like, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.